at the end of June in 2010, most of the harvester ant colonies at Ant Heaven partook in a mating flight. A mating flight in the harvester ants is a very frenzied affair. You can see that workers have uh, spread out from the nest disc a couple of meters away. And uh, in harvester ants, the system is that males fly to the colonies that have the females and the females come out on the nest disc and the males uh, find and try to mate with the females. Here you see a mating pair. Workers seem to try very hard to interfere with these matings and perhaps this is uh, one reason why in harvester ants the females mate with an average of uh, 7 to 12 or so males. That is, they don't just mate with one male. Here you can see the mating is slowed down to one-tenth speed with the worker tugging at the male and another worker uh, doing something with a female. And here comes another male in to see whether he can get in on the action. Here is a still of a mating pair with the male identified and the female identified. This is at normal speed and you can see it's, it's quite a frenetic affair. Here it is slowed down to one-tenth speed. Um, the actions of insects are often, in fact, small animals in general often seem very fast to us. And there is a scaling of the speed of movement as animals get bigger, their relative speed of movement decreases. Males are continually running around patrolling the surface of the, of the uh, nest disc, um, thereby bringing them into contact with mating pairs. And here you see workers apparently trying to break up this mating pair. They do occasionally succeed. The male flies off and tries to find another female to mate with. A male just flew in and attempted to copulate and then flew out again because this female was occupied. Sometimes the balls of males, females and workers get pretty large. This pair was copulating quietly until workers discovered it, and now it's looking complicated. As I noted at the beginning, males leave their natal nest, fly to the female nests, and uh, mate with the females there. The females, once they've mated with enough males, take wing and fly off some distance and attempt to initiate their own colony.